This is Shekhar Srinivasan, a Microsoft Certified Trainer and the Plural Site Author. Before I continue with the video, a small information. If you are new for .NET and a Plural Site subscriber and wanted to learn ADO.NET in detail with examples, then please watch my course ADO.NET by Examples at Plural Site for better understanding of ADO.NET. In this video, we shall understand one of the performance improvements features introduced in C Sharp 7, which focus on reducing the copy of data between memory locations, that is local functions. Local functions allow the declaration of helper functions nested inside other functions. Local functions not only reduce their scope but also allows the use of variables declared in their encompassing scope without allocating additional memory on the heap or stack. Now let us understand with the demo. Understand the advantage of local functions. Let me add a class and provide a meaningful name for this as local functions demo and let me click on add button the first thing we need to perform is to add an entry point so let me type in svm and press the tab to create the main method whenever we are developing the applications we might often need to create methods that are not reused that is you need them just for modularity or imagine a situation where you would need a helper function that would be called just once. Before C Sharp 7, we could have achieved this using func and action types with anonymous method. And if you are not aware of func, action, predicate or anonymous methods of C Sharp, Please watch my video in YouTube to get clear idea. Now my requirement is I would like to have a helper function which should accept two numbers and that method should return the sum of the two numbers. So if we use the previous versions of C sharp then what we need to use is a func delegate. So let me type in var add equal to new func of int comma int comma int of number one comma number two goes to number one plus number two and once we defined the delegate now in order to get the result we can type in where result equal to add of 10 comma 20 and let us display the value so let me type in console dot right line of sum of 10 and 20 is result now let me save the file and let me set this class as the startup object and let me execute the application we can observe the result as sum of 10 and 20 is 30 but however we have few challenges this concept does not support generics params ref and out parameters now with C sharp 7, we can now declare such functions inside the body of another function. Such functions are known as local functions. In other words, the support for local functions enables us to define a function within the scope of another function. So now let me update my previous code with the new C sharp 7 local functions. Let me first comment the func delegate statement declaration. And now my requirement is to add a local function for adding two numbers. So what I can do is just type in int add of int number one comma int number two. And within the body of the method, I can just type in return number one plus number two. We can define this method anywhere locally within a function and it can be consumed anywhere within that method. Now let me save this file and once again let me execute the application. We can observe the same result. Now one important point that we need to remember is that 
the support for local functions is an excellent new feature that has been introduced in C Sharp 7. Remember that we can define local functions inside any method, constructor of a class or inside a property that is in both getter and setter. When the local functions are compiled by the C Sharp compiler, a local function gets transformed into a private method. Hope you will enjoy my videos as much as I enjoy in producing. If you like this video, please give a like, share or comment and do subscribe my channel. This encourages me to produce more videos. Thank you all. Happy programming.